Or maybe this is the bathroom. Yeah, that's the You're right. This is the bathroom. Yeah. There it is. You're caught. At a certain point, we brought on other editors. And it was a really great um, process. The editors that we hired, uh, they didn't have time to watch all the footage, but uh, we wanted them to watch the, the interview with Robert Durst. Um, and Shelby Siegel, who some of you maybe know, is a fantastic uh, New York editor. Um, she was watching the uh, final interview with Bob and found a piece of audio that had been overlooked where he goes into the bathroom and says, there it is, you're caught. And then the audio cut out. I don't know how many of you know, know the program Pluralize, but sometimes when you shoot with a lot of cameras and a lot of different audio things, you use this program which kind of looks at the waveforms and syncs it all up. And so what you get is like a timeline and then like video that's sunk up and then gaps where there's no video. We all freaked out. Oh, she found this thing, game changer. I mean, it was incredible. We freaked out. Everybody freaked out. Um, because we were always wondering, like, did he know just how incriminating it, this was? He played it pretty cool. I mean, that night I was, like, kind of sitting at home and thinking, you know what, I don't ever remember, like, stopping the audio recorder. So I think there might be more of this sort of thing. And so one of the things I want to say just <laughs> about, about it is that the way it was recorded was that um, all the mics were sort of run together. Andrew had a mic, Bob had a mic, there was a mic in the room. And so the sound guy was listening and what he heard was Andrew talking and that's what he heard. And so it wasn't until we went back, found the raw, went back, looked at the time code, found the piece of audio that would have gone after that, dragged it in, there was no video that went along with it. And when we muted all the other tracks, you could see like the one waveform that was Bob's mic and it was like quiet and like a little thing and quiet and like a little thing. And so we all were in the edit room together. We all sort of packed into this small thing and we're sort of like, what is he gonna, like what is it he gonna say in this bathroom? And we would play it and he say like, uh, arrest him. I, I don't know what's in the house. And you rewind it you're like, oh my God, did you just hear that? That's insane, you know? And so it was this process of as we were going, we we're listening to it and getting farther and farther and farther and farther. And then he says the last thing, which he says in the uh, film. What the hell is Rachel? Kill them all, of course. Everybody lost it. I mean, it was just this incredible moment that I, I mean, it was just, I, I can't really describe. The excitement that the people watching it felt, nothing in, compared to what I felt <laughs> after having worked on it for, for so long. And I mean, everybody on the team. It was, it was a crazy, crazy experience. And we had other endings. I mean, other endings, it was going to end much more like kind of by the book with a curtain call and title cards and, and that kind of thing. So. That's, that's the story. <laughs> <laughs>